for this situation, I'd highly recommend the MI-28 with this nice whittle machine, uh, 20 millimeter cannon that, uh, <laughs> can kill shit. <laughs> I hope they re-kit to do- Yes! 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 Alright, now it's gonna get brutal. <laughs> it's exactly what I wanted to see. Otherwise, Green Force sending in more infantry. But we have a lot of Green Force guys. Looks like they're going around. I don't want them to do that. I still want them to fight what we've got here. But U.S. guys are very close by. Nemesis is going to give some support. But now, this other squad really needs to come in and put up the pressure. Because we're going to run into the exact same issue that these guys did. And they're going to be heavily suppressed by the tier 3s, and they're going to probably not be able to move, because with the combination of the AI and the tier 3s firing on this There's group of tier 2s, it's not going to work too well. Three, 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 so I'm not sure if Teacher grabbed their comm net and is uh, exchanging information. I don't hear them talking Just about it. There in the open. Otherwise, hmm. And drop me down. So they just said something about a Sniper sitting in the open. I'm willing to bet it's probably Mirawell. Yep, I just saw a tracer shot go on him. They're trying to get him. Yep, another shot. Mirawell, he heard that. He's going to run off. Perfect. So Nemesis. Oh, God. Nemesis is right on him. If he were to... Po yeah. A little more, buddy. A little more. You're going to get great eyes. He just saw them. Runs in. I think Chult just saw him as well. But look at this, Nemesis is going to go for the outflank. Staying low. Go Gotta remember, they're locked the first person here. Go ahead, have a look. Oh no, with that 249 Bravo. I'm sensing that we look at this! Oh, he threw the flash! He flashed himself! Oh, it's over! He's gonna throw another one to try to save himself. Let me, free, let me rephrase it. We will be expecting an MI-24 on from the T3. Be clear to engage. Copy that. Like a viper, I will wait until the best time. So I'm gonna put down a few Tigresses and Cheetahs around the base. I'm currently, it's very crackly due to me being so. Hold on. And almost ten clicks away from you. Eyes on uh, M249 on top of the So that was house, a great sparring. Five, three. On top of the hill. But I'm going to put up these defenses here for the tier 3s. Basically some anti-air. But I think Gavalor is basically using his uh, radar. Rube's also back at base. So I'm going to put down some cheetahs as well. And this is just our AA, and then they cut their fuel so they don't find their way into the AO. But they've got a pretty big engagement zone, so... I'm not worried about that. Nemesis is still alive from that, but he was able to down two people. He was able to hit the commander and their medics. Or in one of their medics. Honestly, as a tier 3, that's the best thing he could do. So I think Hob might have seen him, but otherwise he's staying put. <clears throat> Chult's checking around, but honestly, there was not a better way they could have hit that. They basically severed their command and hit one of their medics. Best way they could have done that. And Nemesis, I'm surprised Hob didn't see him, but I think he's going to be able to get away from that. But uh, right now, I hear another tier 3. I think that's Rutger telling Nemesis where these guys are, and he's just going to be bandaging himself. Because look, look how wounded he is. His freaking chest, his legs, his arms... Actually, chest looks fine now, but yeah, both arms, his left leg. Ooh, that's tough. What the hell are these idiots doing? So A-10 is going to engage. A-10 is flying south of our current position. Bill and Sniper Wolf are evading him with the MI-28. Oh, they lost their tail rotor. Gav's coming in to try to finish him off. Few more hits. 
Multiple lead is down. Yeah, we're still here. Yeah, we have aircraft. We're in a helicopter right now, dude. Getting fighting to fight and ten. If they fly over base, we have AA support. Uh, this is your Russian commander. Be advised, we do have AA set up at the main base, so if you can get there, we can swat them. Fuck. Gavilor is vicious with that thing. But otherwise, they are quickly taken down. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Got a lot of ground command, hot copy. Still up, Nemesis. This is high command, send traffic. I They've said got a lot of ground command. Down, however, you okay. No, you said high command. You They've said high command, but I'm getting off comms now. Okay, I apologize. Got a lot of ground command. Apologies. Yeah, their ground commands. Yeah, ground commands still being medicked up. Copy that. If you get Roger, back, please relay with him. That Where's Nemesis? Is currently down. I'll join you in a sec. So it looks like Nemesis. Yes. Yeah, so he took out two more people, but otherwise Copy I don't that. see yeah. him. So I think he died and respawned. But he traded. He got two more people. He got FR. Or I think FR was brought in, but he got Shul. Bravo, Trying to find a body now, Lee Garvin. Copy that. Be advised, ground command. Raven will be off station as I, I think Lee Garvin's this. crashing. Re How copy? Otherwise, these guys are still situated uh, yeah, up here. We better get the uh, other chopper and get both in there so we can do long range runs. Be advised, Rob. If we do so, we will lose our ability to do reinserts and cast at the same time. So I'm gonna ungarrison yeah, this group. We can uh, get people in there, but we will. That means we can only do one at a time. Have these guys fight, but yeah, Green Force starting to push in. I understand, but we've got the Tigresses. They are tracking Gavilor, or at least trying to track something. So I think they're gonna rekit as uh, standard infantry. But we need some sort of pilot to come in to try to spar with Gav. Uh, I am very close to giving the order, though, because if these green four guys take care of all these garrison guys, start fighting. I will give the Russians the go order to take the S, uh, the Scud trucks, and try to get out with them. And I'll say we'll mobilize an air as it looks like the commander dies. Unfortunate. But yeah, that's, again, what one tier three can do to the tier 2s, and the tier 2s are still situated up here, and they have not moved. So basically, these guys got pinned down because no support. Rutgers going to come in and make issues even worse for these guys. But at this rate, just the stalling has been very well done by the tier 3s. I expect nothing less. So they're starting to send in some infantry. What bearing are they at? A red cross on the mob. Gav just got shot down. Oh, <laughs> oh! They were here. A lot of dead bodies. It had to have been an igla. That had to have been one of the shoulder-fired iglas by uh, one of these guys, either Troglodyte or Rutger. Wow. I was not expecting that. Somehow, Gavlor got shot down. <laughs> so otherwise, uh, Hob Articus watching rear security actually managed to spot Rutgers, so he's going to go prone and roll to the wall. That's going to tell all of these other guys that the Russian is coming up. Uh, TP to you. So I need to... Yeah, they're here. Right on top of me. Go over... Hey fam, stay alive. I'm coming. Where the heck are you? Do you know where Sniper Wolf is? Because I, I can't find Sniper Wolf right now. Did he switch factions? No. Oh, there he is. 
Ah, uh, player. Well, no shit. I've got the Russian. God damn it. So I think Sniper Wolf just switched teams, which is concerning. We'll see what he wants. That's a U.S. guy. Yo, this is Gavilov at High Command. How copy? This is High Command Center traffic. I just got shot down by enemy. Well, hostile air over our own airfield. Have copy. Well, I guess they're mad because you shot down their MI-28. So shit, sucks to suck. That, that, that's a negative. I got shot down by friendly air cheaters. To be precise. Then I guess you team killed. Yeah, what's up? Hey, can you oh. put me as op for and uh, TP, me, TP me down to the airbase? Oh, that's a man. Yeah, that's that's the guy I'm attached to. Just be careful because he's probably going to start trying to shoot you, frickin'. Uh. Alright, so what? Sniper Wolf, what? I'm behind the car. You want to what? Make Make me a Russian and put me at the Russian base. Oh god. Why? I've already told you. Um, why? We don't have any jet pilots on that side. Then just kit up as a jet pilot. It doesn't work like that. <sighs> For the love of god. It does, but alright. How does it not work like that? Educate you me. You have to be the actual... Yeah, you actually have to be the actual suit man, the actual pilot role to fly a jet. How come? Actual blackout. Oh. Yeah. That's weird. Yeah, I know. Oh, God. Uh, there, your faction switched, so this guy shouldn't shoot at you anymore. Right, so just... wait, they're, they're coming, so you yeah, just make a move. Yeah, just respawn. Yeah, I'll make a move. Get out of here, nerd. All right, a little bit of debugging. At you, you dipshit. Idiot. All right, otherwise, let's get back into this AO here. So I'll put myself in the corner. Do. Let's see where the uh, ally. Okay, yeah. Hey, this is your Russian correspondent. Be advised, the green four u.s back insurgents are getting way so, too close uh can you start pulling the scud missiles back to our main base please so uh uh this is high command to ground command do you copy they're on top of the scud missile Roger, uh, be advised, our friendly insurgents are starting to get way too close to the AO. We fear that the insurgents might start pulling back with the Scud launchers at this time. I can't make heads or tails of what the fuck he's saying. Uh, say again, ha uh, Ground Command. Uh, I cannot. One of them sighted one of the Scud missile trucks, and they're trying to take them for themselves. I don't have any control over what they do. Understood. We have force attacked in the AO area. Uh, if we will go there, I think. Roger. They know not to fire on U.S. guys, but they're coming in pretty close. So you need to either get this done now or. Uh, blow up the scud launcher trucks. Ground, uh, ground command, we have captured one of the squad scud launchers. It's currently moving westwards towards Alpha from Bravo's location, and go and then back to base. Oh, wait, that won't work because I'm an enemy unit. Uh, Bravo, this is this is ground command. Uh, Two of them moving. Two of Otherwise, the ender is back. They're getting All the scud trucks out. Uh, anybody who can copy, we're seeing we uh, from the other compound the scud moving westwards. Is that alpha or is yeah, it enemy? Is friendly. That is friendly to south. Copy that. that. Perfect. We have to, we are capturing two scud right now. Go it's just one of them. 
Oh, that was the scud launcher that just cooked off. <laughs> Eander just made a short second move to scuttle, but we still have this other scud truck right here that can be taken. It is utter chaos right now. So they need at least one more. One of them is really badly fucked because it got hit by that missile, which is very unfortunate, but we also have this other one here. So the fight is going to be now for this one, which is basically on the border. So now the U.S. forces need to come around and try to secure it. Otherwise, I've got these forces that are going to start sweeping in. And we still have a shit ton of garrison forces. I'm going to spawn in some more insurgents from the south. It's starting to get a bit darker. And let's get in That's pretty far for me. these reinforcing Middle Eastern militia. Try and disable the wheels. Alright, meters out. I'm hit it. And then for these squads, I'll try to give them a sense of urgency here to move in. If they're even going to move in, I just gave them a fucking movement order. There we go, now it's starting to queue in. Uh, let me also get on some body deletion here. We got quite a few things that need to get taken down. But here's the other scud launcher. Unfortunately, its wheels are pretty badly fucked. So I'm going to add a bunch of wheels to this Vic. I think it's driving uh, at that red line I just drew. So I can put in a shit ton of wheels. I just put eight in there. So it will be repairable, but otherwise they need to get it done. So one of the scud trucks still going in. I just saw a missile go out. I have no idea where that puppy landed. It looks like it was somewhere over here. But they are now pushing in deeper. I'm going to move myself as the commander back a bit more. I still see players down there. But what was that? That was Rube and another little bird. And they're still getting that missile truck back. So I think he uh, dropped down, let Auntie Static land. These guys are now still engaging with the Ander, but they're not focusing on the objective. Oh, wait, I stand corrected. Murphy! And he's able to get it out. It's very well done. I want to see if this squad's able to secure this other missile truck. Otherwise, Sniper Wolf taking off in a jet. Oh, no. Gavalor needs to get up and provide some air cover right now or else they're screwed. Troglodyte is coming in probably with the reinserts in an APC AD, uh, BTR ADA with that auto cannon. Nemesis is back here. He's providing sniper support. I think he survived. No, he's got a different... Uh, well, no, nah, he's got a new gas. I'm willing to bet he probably died and brought back in. So the other one's coming in. Gavalor... Do you guys, do, how Why is Gavlor just waiting at base? He needs to get a jet and he needs to provide air cover. So otherwise they're going to get... We're going to explode the second truck. We have also captured one of the Russians. He's still alive. They captured one of the Russians? <laughs> they got Eander. Oh man, this is a great victory for the US. But that's only if they're going to be able to keep everything. Because Sniper Wolf is in the air. So I don't know if those missile trucks are going to last because they need Gavalor to get in the goddamn air, otherwise they're screwed. Oh, uh, this ain't gonna be good because the Russians, I gave them the order of if they're being stolen, protocol is they need to be blown up. Makarov, once you got that Russian stabilized, fall back to the northwest. To Aussie close. Once you get to Aussie close, so they're coming to this other one. Roof to come pick you up. Pick him up. This has been very, very close. I'm sorry I haven't been really looking at chat too much, guys, uh, for this op. It's been a very hectic, fast-paced op that I've had to do a lot of micromanagement for. So my sincere apologies. But for the next op, the tier two or the tier three op, depending on what the tier threes want to do, I assure you, I will be a little more interactive with you guys. If you can't, if you cannot, if you. If you cannot repair so they're working the on repairing, uh, fixing the ender. If you can't repair that scud launcher, you clear to destroy it. So, it's 
So they need to, uh, basically, it's okay right now, but it's got a shit ton of wheels in its inventory. So they should be all right. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm going to move myself back a little more because we've got green four guys now coming in and around. Green four insurgents. We might see some possible friendly fire incidents. Why's Flying Finn? He's stuck in the debug corner. He keeps DCing for whatever reason. But I have no idea where Sniper Wolf is at this time. There he is. Way up high. Basically, way in the debug zone as well. I guess he's on station. Bill, can you drop me off soon? I'm going to send all of my Op 4 guys. We're going to go straight to that position. Oh, here comes the APC, though. Oh, no. So they're trying their best to quickly repair all the wheels, but will that APC come in in time to take them out? That's the real question. So these insurgents are going to come in. I'm going to ungarrison my Op 4 guys, and we're going to try to make haste in getting to this compound right here. We're going to try to get our Scud Launcher back, because that's the third one. Otherwise, we're having some shots of being engaged. <laughs> this is that tense part. Having one of these guys looks like he's going to take the stairwell. Wherever it is, come down. He might flank these three guys if they're not being careful. Otherwise, where is that BTR ADA? Got no eyes. Ah, oh, there she is. So she's going around. <clears throat> Meanwhile, Rutger's gonna come up. This is a message over. They're trying to secure. But I have no eyes on Sniper Wolf yet. He has not made his presence known. And these two trucks are still a coming in. Ground. Message over. We're about to see a large amount of casualties. So the insurgents are in. The U.S. guys doing a good, I good job, a PID actually. But otherwise, I guess they're forming a bit of a defensive perimeter. So that's the scud. I'm assuming Rutger can hear that. But I'm gonna add some more spare wheels to this just in case shit happens. Because they also have Deadwalker, the engineer. Uh, we're gonna, we extract currently with the scud. Can you provide helicopter extraction for the rest of the ground forces? With Blackhawk, please. Fuck you. Confirm. We're getting the last of the scuds out, and then we're getting out. Break. We're almost done with the Russian. As soon as we're done with him, we're gonna pick him up and start moving back to the LZ close. Confirm. Yeah. Yeah. I <laughs> Ah, uh, now we're going for the PID. Yeah, I. There's actually a much. Bi there's a very big lack of friendly fire with all these PID units. I'm actually really impressed. Oh, here comes that BTR 88. They're trying to get the AT4 on her. Oh, and there goes the building. Ho 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 ho. They're trying to shoot out her wheels. Very well done. Now he's firing ahead, trying to get those two guys. There's the AT4 hit. It looks like it didn't do that much damage, though, right on the frontal plate. But now he's firing to basically secure, uh, get these guys. So they all are surviving, more or less, but now they're firing some more shots. One of them went right on the Rat King, but it looks like it went right over his head. Yeah, these guys need to fuck off immediately. Rutger looks like something was placed right here, and he trades with Habardicus. And that other Scud truck is now being moved away. So we have our Op 4 forces. Now the US forces need to start getting out of here. I repeat, LZ close. Grid reference 156074. Sniper Wolf is still in the air. I'm not sure again when he's going to make his grandiose appearance. Is that Rube? Understood. We're not yet ready for the extraction. No, that's Murphy. He's uh, gone on a road. Yep. Area near I have no idea where Sniper Wolf wind. is, and that scares me. Otherwise, we got guys back at base. At this point, they need to just scramble aircraft. 
or else it's going to get messy. So they have Eander, they're running back with him. <laughs> um, yeah. We gotta go around this whole shit show, flank around, get on the hill when I die, and then kill him from above, right? Copy. So they're pulling back. I'm gonna switch to night vision now because we're getting a bit dark, but. Okay, because my flown just 600 just now. I'm gonna start tasking all of these units to kind of converge on these U.S. guys. So five Scud trucks were brought in, two were destroyed, one on accident, one on purpose. This has been quite the crazy out, but otherwise infantry are moving out on foot. Okay, we'll close for the pickup point. And they're dragging Habarticus back. Negative Rube, we are currently on hold until they require extraction. We have a shit ton of op four guys coming in. I'm going to start raising things up to get people out of the AO. Now the squad lead's being retarded, so I'm just going to send them in like this. This will make them all go individually. Because at this point, spawn, we know they're here, so we're going to flare this position. Uh, nope. <laughs> Up for... That's how many bullets they take with this frickin... I think they still have that old uh, sniper outpost they had previously crewed. Oh, this is nuts. Cook off, cook off. Yep, so they're able to get everyone out. That's kind of BS in my opinion, but here's what I'm going to do. We're going to use the one weapon that they won't ever suspect. And we're coming in. We'll need immediate extract. We'll need immediate extract on this uh, important individual. Add to the coffee. Under, understood. Uh, I'm gonna task Gavalo to extract your. Oh shit, I don't have that setting set. Fuck, I forgot to change that setting within the tier 2 where you can uh, cable tie them immediately. Mr. J goes down. <clears throat> Bravo. Having a massive amount of reinforcements starting to come in. I just heard something. Rutger comes in. I'm hearing. So that BTR ADA is down, but this MIA, that's a super hind. So they're using this to strike. Now the extraction's where it's going to get messy. Repeat last high command, we had three people talk over each other. So we're gonna steal some people. You are free to move into LZ close. Otherwise, they're grabbing people trying to move them in. Alright, so. If you have a double friend, your enemy gas, just open the map. We have blue force tracking. I think Rucker just pancaked. <laughs> but yeah, this has just turned into a fight of pure air superiority, as Sniper Wolf just said. So you have a lot of ground command. Please confirm possible MIA is down. I'm seeing explosions in the distance. Alright, so that's Mr. J and Deadwalker, so... I can 
confirm it went down, but I cannot confirm that we killed it. Player, I'm seeing positive cook off on my horizon. It seems to be the wreck of a MIA. So, Mr. J. <laughs> and. Hey, Mr. J. Unfortunately, the insurgents got you. Oh, uh, sorry, I had to go FK. Oh, it's fine. I'm just saying, uh, I'm also grabbing Deadwalker. Both of you You're were. Well, I can't hear you, sorry. Yeah, no problem. That's because I was on uh, Whisper, but yeah, um, you were captured by insurgents and brought to me, the evil commander. I can hear it, but so facing us. I know it's because I don't want to. Well, I can turn him. Hold on. Andrews, but we have here for the chopper. Approximately northwest of our position. Oh uh, yeah, sure. Hold on. Well, I'm not going to use it to listen in. Um. But yeah, it's right now just a massive air superiority shit show, and it is amazing. This guy is going to land over approaching out the landing zone. Here in Sniper Wolf and Bill organize things. But as you can see, that's well, without NVGs. Because I'm a medic, I can heal you. Actually, a pretty good one at this Actually, you're both uh, completely healed. Yeah. Oh, I was still trying to you. Master, oh, I'm I'm fine, but uh, yeah, you know we've uh, lost two U.S. guys. You guys will be part of the next tier two mission if we do it today or next week, depending on what the tier threes want. But how'd you guys like that? Sneaky spit. That's not trying to sneak the whole thing. Yeah. So, Barty Lord with his Blackhawk actually got shot down. Otherwise, I still hear Sniper Wolf marauding around. There he is. Still in the air. Still spinning. What's next? Well, you guys can feel free to watch the stream because I don't think you're going to be rescued. <laughs> no, to be fair, the guy who I was medking yeah, I hear it. Yeah, he's on the ground. He's on the ground. He's on the While I took a nade to the face. So. <laughs> yeah. He's taken off again. That didn't quite work out for me. But I was. I was getting medic by foreskin and then the wolves caught up here. Yeah, that happened to me. I just, like. Uh, oh! <laughs> that, did not, that did not go well for me. We thought they were friendly and then they started shooting at us. Yep. There's still guys down there. I see at least one guy. Good. Oh man, so the air extract has been Why horrible. Otherwise, He's Nemesis sorry, is marauding. Is he just gonna do a 360 on me? Uh, <laughs> this scrap. <laughs> I can't believe that just oh, might, Sniper Tiger's still I'm getting out. So. Um, oh, yeah, you're fine. I'm the one Murphy's bringing down. that puppy back, and I'm trying to see if they got one of them back already. What time is though it, it doesn't look like it. So there's two Scud trucks coming back right now. I forget who was driving the first one. I think it went down. But yeah, uh, Hill wins, by the way. <laughs> Hill beats Chopper. Uh, so, yeah, they're calling a strike danger close. danger close. Yeah, I know. I'm looking at you. What was that? Alright, well, I'll, I'll, I'll sure, okay. Uh, no, that's their, uh, that's the Spetsnaz aircrafts, uh, doing a gun run on where players were, but everyone is dead or pulling back at this point. That's about where they landed, yeah. I guess. Oh man, but this extract was an absolute shit show. Oh, cool. I'm sub uh, three months here now. <laughs> it's great. I really need to stop playing medic and start playing something else. Maybe AT. So at the very least, send in goat team six. <laughs> Dead Walker, three months in the row, as you just said. Deadwalker, my friend, thank you so much for everything. Hope you enjoyed today's app.
<laughs> there, in real time, I can give you a shout out. Hey. I want to see that video. This is high command on all nets. Uh, mission is a success on both teams, and I will explain why in debrief. Oh. Is that why we were captured? Probably. Very well done. Mm. <clears throat> bacon. I want your bacon. Give me your bacon. So we'll now jump into this was one hell of a funnel. All right, everyone, break. Andrew, hot mic. Andrew, Andrew. Hot mic. yeah. All right. So here's the deal. Uh, Blue four got their objective done. Two out of the five, technically four, Scud missile trucks are on their way back to base, and they were on their half of the map. But up for, I'm going to say they still did something very significant because all of you guys that respawned in the crash landing, uh, up for forces were close enough and I'm going to count them as being taken by the uh, up for forces. So six U.S. soldiers were captured, uh, two by insurgents and four from up for forces. However, I believe one up for four uh, unit was also taken as well. Yeah, yeah so, but he crashed with the helicopter. Oh, he crashed with the helicopter? Okay, so he yeah, was yeah. then recovered. So US got their thing well, done, but up recovered. four are gonna be able to get a shit ton of critical intel to mess with US forces and possibly hinder the process of getting those scud trucks back to base and hidden so it's i think it's a win on everyone's book uh i think everyone did really really well tonight it was a good balance of power good use of assets we really saw you know the tier threes flex their muscle and harass the tier twos where they could and uh, i hope you all enjoyed that because as your zeus i definitely did that was the fact funny. that the helicopter crashed because of a glitch going to matter at all uh, it, yes, yeah, but that, here's the deal. Mountains don't count as glitches. It, it was a no. mountain. It the was helicopter the going. helicopter was going more than a fucking kilometer an hour. Yeah, which the, the is helicopter one of the fucking safe. glitches on this map. It, it happened all yeah, the time. We remember Jack last... was about to make another pass on y'all Please anyways. break. Yeah. Break, remember break. Wait. So wait, some time ago, when we had an MI8 at the Russians on the same map, and we were going like 800 kilometers an hour, and we were not unable to, unable to land. It was me, Bart, and Gavador. This has happened multiple times on this map already. I mean, I'll tell you what I saw. I saw a helicopter flying too low and hitting a mountain. No, that was That's not the same that there. I saw after I shot at it. Not the thing that it would matter anyways, because there was an air superiority jet moving in to fucking kill you guys. Now, Look, the thing is, though, I'm going to counter up that statement is that we were going faster than a jet at one point. Excuses are like assholes. Okay, hold on, has one. hold on, break, break. You can't blame the glitch for the reason you crashed and then state that that glitch would have been the reason why you outran the air superiority jet that killed you, that would have killed you anyway. <laughs> no, so we either way, break, break, would... shut the fuck up. Here's the deal. You can't do that. So either way, I'm counting that as part of the victory conditions for both sides, whether you like it or not, because of that statement that you just yeah. made. Regardless, it happened. I hope you still had a bunch of fun. So, whatever. It's all part of the fun anyway. Uh, Lira, just... Lira, did you, did you capture the crash on your stream, though? Yes. You weren't going okay, at 800 yeah, miles an hour the, for me, you just kind of plummeted uh, into a hill. Okay, as, as a counterbalance, they can have the kill, it just becomes a highlight video. Trust me, there's... <laughs> I have a lot of highlights from that stream. Uh, no, here, Rube definitely Bill. just plowed oh, into a hill. Well, no, that wasn't Rube. Quick break, quick yeah, break. Uh, Bill, you want to explain what happened to that first Scud truck for everybody? Because people are curious. Tell yeah, me. I've played a lot of Battlefield lately, and friendly mines don't kill friendly vehicles. And apparently in armor, <laughs> when you place a fucking mine three meters behind a Scud truck, it counts as pressure plate. I don't know how that pressure plate is actually <laughs> working, but yeah. I've put the mine down, set it to pressure plate way behind it, and... That's okay. so funny. Uh, also... Also, uh, Russian body that mine is was pretty way good too because close. I walked behind somebody, shot them five times, gun jam, then they turned around and just one tap killed me. Sounds about right. 
You can thank no, Nemesis Rucker. for that. Yeah. If you went also, behind, why is that Rucker? Also, tips to the people that have their graphic settings that's so extremely fucking low that they don't even see grass. Me. Uh, I, I see grass yeah, though. Flanking around the whole fucking town, whatsoever you're sitting in. Moving through grass, all of a sudden fucking MG hell breaks loose because people don't have grass on. I would really uh, hope you no, have the money to buy fucking... Not their fault. It's it's I, more the... I had grass on, but I still shot at you because I saw it. It's more the yeah. fact of you had the drone overlooking your Yeah, ship Bill, the uh, they did have like yeah, was three good. drones in the air. And they were const I constantly saw people going in and checking on them. And honestly, I was in there in 24-7 in the drone. Quick break, break. I will say the drone use tonight was very on point. It was probably the best drone use I've seen for a combination of spotting targets, guiding bombs into targets to free up the use of other assets. And I'm I'm just very impressed with all you guys tonight. That was great. I will say there also, was a few counts of being shot through walls by the AI, but other than that. Oh, that was amazing. I that, watched that. That, 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 that's okay, here's the, here's the deal. Some of that... I did on purpose with some vehicles to suppress buildings that I saw like five people run in. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm going to I'm going to counter building. that I'm going to counter that thing of AI shooting through walls. As a <clears> player, <throat> I've shot through walls many many times against the AI because you know you can hear the AI's footsteps, you can hear the AI talking, whatever. Yep. And then they shoot huh. through the walls. So then I always assume that the AI is doing this. Same thing. Mm -hmm. As long as the AI is shooting through a wall that they can shoot back through, and they don't, and they're not poking their barrel through some in, uh, some steel barrier I can't penetrate, I don't care to do that because then I can just shoot through the building as well. All right, here's so, yeah, the deal. Here's the deal. Um, I do have one gripe I want to talk about, but first, do the tier three guys want an op for themselves? I do have a really cool small tactical op idea in my head that I'd love to do for you guys. Otherwise, we can do another tier two op. Uh, tier threes. Like tier three. It's been too long. Tier three, yeah. tier three. Yeah. Tier three. All right, we'll do a tier yeah. three. Uh, I will start setting that up accordingly. Let me restart the server. Uh, the only thing I want to say before I now kick out all the tier twos, haha, is when you vault a wall, make sure that that wall is clear. Because if you <laughs> vault a wall yeah. right in front of an enemy infantry unit, auntie... I will shoot you, and that, I will try to deliberately kill you. Should have been cleared because my troops we were we about two hundred meters in front of me. It should have been cleared. Also, could I say something? <laughs> shoot. Yeah, go and ahead. I still got okay. you. Okay. Okay. Um, Alpha. Uh, I kept some terms of look. So I'm gonna start prepping oh, yeah, here for you. English. Yeah, Nash, your mic's uh, cutting out pretty I, bad. I don't know what was. Okay, maybe I'll try this way. Anyway, so I was overlooking Alpha position where you guys were fighting one person there. Um, how often do you guys check the map? Do you have the map tabbed on your right side of the screen or the left side so you can always see it, right? Uh, yeah. for, like, what What do you mean, like, I, check the map? Like, check the map on the map or yes. check the GPS? GPS, okay, right. The GPS, GPS can open. still the GPS can still find map markers, right? So you guys were fighting that one person over there. I was overlooking it. I, I literally, I didn't have popcorn, but I was so fucking awesome to see because you guys probably didn't get a glimpse of what to do there. So you all, the guy went away, backed off to your corner to bandage himself. Uh, every, every, you guys, like, oh, there's no contact anymore. Everybody started bandaging themselves, and so were the tier three. So I about spam like. 13, 20 map markers on the location where the guy was. None of you guys checked it. And I was literally tearing my hair out on how can you guys not see the map markers that I just placed, you guys. Was it, it was on side About chat? like five meters from you. They were on the side chat. I didn't on the map markers as all at all? Markers. Like literally the guy, uh, I think it was Hoparticus that got the guy at the end. And where Hoparticus was, the guy was pretty much there for like one minute other side of the wall with you himself. So, wait, yeah. wait, did you, you ah, called him on, on the, on the radio that you saw him, right? Yeah, we, I called it him, but yeah, you were well, down I was, there. I was down. Yeah, I, I, yeah had... I saw you killed there, so... Come on, Mr. Uh, server. Yeah, yeah he called it was... out several times on Bravo, then... Uh, he asked for the Alpha's frequency, which, since I was there, I gave it to him, and... 
And yeah. yeah, when I got the free kit, it was too late already. Oh, but it was killed him, but they, yeah, they, it was really fucking fun to watch. Shame that case. I didn't record it though. Yeah, just just a quick question. Any problems with my squad leading or commanding? Uh, I, I was on multiple nets, so I don't have anything to say. You can die? Yeah. Also, I died right, once. I don't know if you, uh, uh, know if you uh, noticed this, but I think there was an instance where I was uh, packing, uh, who was it, Mr. J? And then a fire team decides to just walk past us very narrowly, and then proceed to shoot us, and I just book it into the. Yeah, that was me. Thank yeah. you for booking. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, no one clue. thing before I go, just wanna just wanna say to everybody that was an alpha team, you guys actually did uh, keep up the momentum. I was happy with that. I'm gonna go up and watch the stream of what's happening now. Wait a sec, Andrew. And so, something important. Where would Tra go? I need him. Oh, something important. Does anybody want to see what a three hours pizza inside of oven that I forgot about looks like? <laughs> oh, Show it! Oh, yes! Please. Oh man. Oh god, Makarov. Please. Hold on. You put there when we're playing. Uh, if it ain't Oda. luck, it ain't burn. <laughs> Let me see. Well, you guys do realize I'm still streaming right now, so <laughs> keep matter. the racism to a minimum, please. Can I say one thing related to ops? Why every, every time we have tier 3 or above against us, they only snipe and lob rockets, and only apparently Billman try to do something tactical? Because that's all like, they I want did to as do. well. I well, got I mean, three guys up in one compound. Well, when like we moved them. inside um, the town, everybody Who was the guy that to... was sniping on that roof, uh, on the same roof the entire time? Tears 3 job me. isn't to kill totally you guys <laughs> outright and yeah, actively try to assault you. They're, that's not their job. They don't have the numbers for that. Their Why job is to just you harass five? you. Why would we five try and move on you when we can just sit back and snipe you? Yeah. yeah. And low uh, rockets. There, there's absolutely oh, yeah, no some reason for them to move up to us. We will come to them anyways. Uh, we just send the yeah. jolt. You'll get better FPS with everything on high, because if you have it on high, your GPU will be used instead of your CPU. 